everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to The Smuggler in the Blind, episode 11. Um, so I've gone, got myself to level 26, I'm nearly level 27, as you can see. I, I, I left these guys because they carried on fighting after I died. Gone and done a bunch of heroics, come back, and they're still fighting. Yeah, so when you think about it in game time, in, you know, like story time from where I've gone, you know, I've gone from like Coruscant to uh, back to here, they've probably been fighting for, I'd say, a few days. You know, if you're going to count travel time, like, you know, realistic travel time, because you know how if you're in a ship and you go to a planet in like a few seconds, that wouldn't happen in like Star Wars at all. It would take at least maybe an hour or so, depending on where you're going. At least, because, you know, you don't see them in the movies getting to a place instantly. But anyway, I guess I'll <laughs> rejoin the fight. Um, yeah. But I'm a bit more powerful now, so I should be able to kill them. Hooray! Oh, I need to drop that first. Maybe uh, wait for it to drop properly before I uh, move out the way. But hey, at least I should kill them now. Oh, look, she's dying so easily. Ah, oh, there we go. He's had enough. Look at this. So lovely. Cool, well, they're both dead. Um, is, is, what's his face still dead? I forgot his name. It's been a week. Is he still dead as well? Um, I didn't see him die. Not many can claim they battled a Sith and lived. You're in rare company. Well... You took some hits. Any of them leave a mark? My injuries will heal soon enough. I see now why Zare thought this box was worth killing over. Thank the Force we stopped her. This is a Sith holocron. It was created centuries ago by a powerful Dark Lord called Darth Nihilus. You're not gonna go all Sithy just by holding it, are you? It doesn't quite work like that. But your concern is duly noted. It's more like a Jedi I'll hologram. ensure this relic remains safely hidden from Zare's allies. The Empire must never access the terrible secrets contained here. My ship is waiting nearby. I should go. We've saved countless lives today. I mean, the Sith one is sort of like the triangle red one, isn't it? Well, you know, I guess that could be anything. Put in a good word about me with your Jedi friends. Goodbye. May the Force protect you. You're gonna put in a word about me, yeah? Yeah? Mario! Oh well. Retrieve the sensor computer. It's over here. Yeah, he's he's kind of just disappeared now. Oh well. Um. Oh, they're both the sensor computer. I could do any of them. All right, that's fine. Nag Drayen. Nag Drayen. That's all I hear. What was it like to fight Nag Drayen? Oh, the next time some fool asks me that, I'll bury this hollow recording in his forehead and play it back for the survivors. <laughs> Nog Drain was never a true gangster. Not like me. He just pretended. People think I fought him because he was more successful. Because he made me number two. Because he stole my wife. Lies! I fought him because he was no more a gangster than I am a senator. Nog was a con artist. The whole underworld was his mark. He was using us for something. Don't know what. But I do know he never gave a damn about being king of the underworld. It was all just a game. At least that pile of filth is finally dead. I raided his storehouse just to be sure. He never came. I'm still alive and he's not. I won. You hear that knock? I won. Probably not if he's dead. Just could point that out. Ah, oh, okay. So, yeah. So, why? Why? Right. Retrieve the hol retrieve the sensor computer. I click on that. That just gives me a hollow projection of Diago's taunt to a s dead Noctrain. So why isn't it whatever? Whatever. Okay. Well. Fine. That 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 done. Okay, we're gonna return to Risha. Um, y you know, it's a bit concerning to be honest with you. What am I doing that for? I need to do. Uh, that yeah, um, yeah. It's it's a bit bit worrying, you know how he's being all like, oh, knock drain as con artist. Well, what if there is no fortune? What if the fortune isn't real? Have you ever thought about that? I mean, I certainly have. Risha, I am done. Wasn't sure I'd see you alive again, much less with that sensor computer. How did you get it? 
Tiago Hickson passed away unexpectedly. <laughs> left me a generous inheritance. He's dead? Good. I mean, for your reputation. If you say Sorry so. I didn't get a chance to chat with him before he died. My hollow malfunctioned. Right. That blob of a gangster took a real interest in you. I'm sure he reacts like that to all the beautiful girls. With that sensor computer installed, this freighter will be a first-rate scout vessel. I'll patch it into the ship's rectenna before takeoff. You should notice a difference right away. What exactly will that gizmo do for us? Let's just say people will have a hard time sneaking up on us in space. Let's leave this sandball in our rear thrusters, Captain. Nakdrayan's fortune is out there waiting for us. And done. Take that and level 27. And a bunch of influence as well. Ooh. Let's do some talking, shall we, about her? I am thinking what I owe you. On Kashyyyk, we spoke of life debts. Uh oh. A woman whose life was saved owed his service for life. That sounds like slavery. Or worse, marriage. No thanks. <laughs> I have been a slave. I would not do it again for any debt. I do honor you. I will not leave lightly. I got no hold on you. Thank you. You serve the Republic. You fill your pockets. Both are good. But there is more. Others suffer while I am free. I would help them if I can. Okay, you're gonna bring up a life debt, but you're not gonna give me a life debt. All right, and you know, you stay, you stay, you stay free, you know, All right. So we're heading to Alderaan, I believe. Next, we are indeed. It's exactly where Kashila is right now. Kashila, what? No. Let's start. I'm, I keep getting my Jedi Knight and my Sith Inquisitor mixed up. I mean, they're both as ruthless as each other, mind you. Although I think the Staria is a bit more evil, to be honest. But hey, at least I'm now kind of the level for Alderaan. Yeah, compared to when I was on Tatooine, and I'm gonna do some more leveling up as well. I just did some heroics, basically. Um, oh, now you automatically activate. Certainly is the prettiest world on our itinerary. Don't let all that breathtaking scenery fool you, though. This is the most dangerous planet of the core worlds. The nobles here could teach the Sith a few things about backstabbing and assassination. Great, a planet of two-faced killers. They say every noble who's anyone has killed at least one person, even if by accident. Every so often, the noble families spill their bloodlines fighting for the throne. The current succession war is the bloodiest on record. Since the Empire arrived to put its own puppet in charge, there's no telling who will come out on top. Who's the big shot around here? House Algo sees the throne, but maybe not for long. The whole planet's a war zone. The first time I visited, I thought all the nobles were so glamorous. Then I saw the truth. These people don't know how lucky they are, or what they should do with their fortunes. They don't deserve to rule. You don't need to spend your fortune. I mean, every time I get paid, I lose like half my money because I spend it on crap I don't need. I don't have much use for aristocrats. You just haven't met a good one. Maybe I'll introduce you to one someday. Your first delivery is a piece of glaze cake. Ooh! All you have to do is escort that antique power droid to House Organa's castle. Since House Organa runs this spaceport and their castle is right around the corner, dropping off the droid should be a quick run. The droid's my first delivery. What's the second? One deal at a time, Captain. Let's focus on dumping that bucket of bolts. The droid belongs to a couple of young nobles, Len Teron and his sister Sidonia. Decent people, all things considered. Got it. I'd better get moving. I mean, I, 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 thought, you, I thought you said it was a glaze cake. Oh, I'm curious. What is this? Oh. It's a head. A human head. Alright, I uh, sorry I asked. Do 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 Reminds me of like gold chime music or something like that. I don't know. Some sort of medieval kind of World of Warcraft music. No, no 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 no. It reminds me of Gilneas. Yes. Well, this part doesn't. You know, the do 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 I'm moving on now. I swear either way could look like a dead end. You look here, it looks like a dead end. You go there, it looks like a dead end. It's only when you sort of go like that you realise it's not. Yeah. Yeah, I'm curious. I've never actually looked down here. It always looks so pretty. Ooh. 
Ah. Also, you, you, you might want to be careful that you don't fall off, because if you fall off, um... You, you're, you're probably gonna slide down and probably never be found. Ever again. You know, I'll tell you something, doing heroics in this game kind of made me want to, uh... Do some more in this game, because I've, I've now got crew skills. Um, I'm very, very, very slowly starting to do them now, because I do need to get the arms tech up. Uh, well, I need to get all, th like, six of them up for um, the Dark vs. Light event. I really want to try and do as many objectives for the Light vs. Dark event as I can, uh, but I've really not got much time. I mean, people have been doing this for, you know, the past two months, however long this has been going on for, and I don't even think they've got them all yet. And there's me, who wants to start right now, and probably won't even bother 100%, won't even put 100% of my time in it, so I'm probably never going to do it. I want to at least, at least, see if I can um, just get the companion. Whether it's going to be light or versus dark, I don't mind. I just want the companion, because I'm a completionist, and I want to try and get everything for Kranatoko, well, as everything that I can, I can possibly get. Um, and if I don't get that companion... Uh, although, you know, when it comes to PvP, that's never going to happen because there's some season rewards which I've completely missed now. Um, not that I do ranked because... Yeah, I, I need to bring back PvK. I really do. I really enjoy PvK because the last episode I did, I did very well. And then I just, just stopped because you guys weren't really watching it, so... Then again, I'm doing this, and you guys aren't watching it, so hey. Whoop. <laughs> sorry, of course, I interrupted what you are going to say. What were you going to say? Uh, what do we do if some duke or baroness shows up? Salute, curtsy, wink knowingly, uh, do all three. Why the hell not do all three? Although, when he went, whoop, it kind of reminded me of Gangnam Style. Watch, I'll prove it to you. Opa Gangnam Style. See? I'm an idiot, I know. Uh, Len Turan, hello. You made a deal with a woman named Risha for this droid. Risha! I'm here to collect. Welcome home, you ugly little thing. I mean the droid, of course. Uh, yeah. This is no time for your juvenile jokes. We should properly introduce ourselves. I am Lady Sidonia Terran, herald of the Gold Aurora. Why, hello. And I'm her brother, Lord Len Terran, Warden of the Eternal Flame. Please call me Len. Why, hello again. What should I call your beautiful sister? Seti. She loves that. Please don't listen to my brother. He has the unfortunate quality of being an idiot. My brother and I are all that remains of House Turan's noble bloodline. One of Alderaan's more reprehensible pedigrees, House Bailis, slaughtered our family and seized all our holdings. You sound very upset about that. You still have this old clanker, for whatever it's worth. This droid holds new hope for us, literally. Centuries ago, our ancestors hid something inside it for safekeeping. Pirates absconded with the unfashionable machine generations ago. Tracking it down has consumed our family since before we were born. What that droid contains will rebuild House Turan, but we need instructions to safely open the hidden compartment. It's rigged to explode, you see. Uh -oh. The instructions are at our family's estate, now occupied by House Bayliss's forces. Without those instructions, we can't pay you. Clean up this mess yourself. I'm done. Unless we recover what's inside the droid, it's of no use to us. The instructions Blackmail. we need are in a data pad of Tehran family history at our estate's library. If you retrieve that data pad, we'll add a substantial bonus to your payment. And there are some additional family heirlooms we'll pay you handsomely to recover while you're there. So, let me get this straight. You're not going to pay me until I've recovered the data pad, right? But you'll add a bonus if I recover the data pad. What? What kind of security does your estate have? Hard to say. I'm sure Bayliss installed new systems after we fled. Len, it's time for your meeting with House Organa. Don't keep their counselors waiting this time. You just want this handsome stranger to yourself. Maybe I want Next you! Next time, dear sister, you get to beg our hosts for their table scraps. I should head out too. Another time then. Goodbye for now. Maybe another time. But I'm trying to be betrothed to Risha. But you are very tempting for Harlow. 
just gonna point that out. It's a new hope, eh? Oh, bye, droid. Bye, bye. It's a new hope, eh? You know, they should make a movie about a new hope. Oh, wait. Jumping for my life and hoping to survive! I survived. Ah, oh, I don't have an XP boost up again. I keep forgetting about putting up XP boosts. Oh, is this a three hour one? Yeah, three hour. Look, bloody hell! Oh, yeah, I did a bunch of uh, heroics, didn't I? Should we see what I got? Let's see what I've got. Um, oh, I don't actually have this. I should probably take that. Lovely. <gasps> Woo! Lovely. I gotta open them all, see if I get anything good. Woo! It's getting better! Oh, look at that! Oh, yeah! Oh my god, I'm getting so excited. Look at all this. Well, I don't need you anymore because I've already got like two of you now. Uh, I've dropped, I got this as well. Don't need that. Cool. Uh, anything else? Ooh. Another, I need another one. That's good. Um, ooh, I'll take that. Yes, I will. Yes, I will. Yes, I will. Um, don't need you. Oh, yes, I do. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never been so excited for stuff I've got from Heroics in my entire life. Oh my god! Oh my god, I need one of those too! I've never been so excited. Never been so excited. Have I got any abilities as well? Oh my god, I do as well! Speed of piloting! <gasps> Slice droid. Steady shot. <sighs> Stay is getting better and better. Oh my god, look how my character looks compared to his costume. I mean, that's his costume. Wait, that's how he looks. And that's his costume. Which one would you prefer he would he looks like? Which prefer he looks like a pirate or a smuggler? I'd prefer he looked like a smuggler. You know, the way I got excited it reminds me of that sponge lady. I don't know if you've ever seen it. There's like this sponge lady uh, circling around on the internet and she gets so excited by wiggles and just sort of the sp the, what the sponges can do. It's... If I can find the video, I'll link it in the description, but she just gets so excited over it, and it's absolutely amazing. Why is there a bird up there that's just not going anywhere? It's just stuck there. It's not a bird, it's a thranta, I think, like a baby thranta, but it's just stuck there. Poor baby thranta. Oh, and if you do click on the link in the description, please sort of post a comment in that video to say I brought you there, because I want recognition. Now, do we recover the heirlooms as well? Mmm... I mean, it's only 8,000 experience. It's kind of nothing, but it's experience nonetheless, so I probably should. It seems like an easy one as well. I mean, yeah, there's going to be enemies kind of in my way everywhere, and these are level 29, so it's gonna, they're going to start gaining levels. Eee. No, don't go there, because I'll attract their attention. Do you see what I was just trying to say? I love how he felt going up there was a better spot for him. Um, no, because you're about to die now. And there you go, you're dead. Oh, I wish I could stealth. That way I can just walk on past all of these people. I mean, I'll go hide in the bushes, shall we? Let's go hide in the bushes. Hee hee hee. I'm a snake. Oh, they saw me in the bushes! Ah, I'm not snake after all. You know, in theory, you two could just go over there and be all like, hey! I'm being attacked. Help me. But no, no, you, you, you can't do that because you're only a... Oh, now you do it as you die. It's annoying as well. These guys aren't even a bonus. What? What the hell did I do? Have I got myself a trigger figure or something? Am I accidentally attacking people I don't intend to attack? Ugh. As I was trying to say, it's kind of annoying that these guys aren't a bonus mission because I'd probably be doing that right now. But no, the game doesn't want to give me the bonus mission where it mostly matters. Alright, number one. Done. Where's number two? Up here. Wait, I didn't need to kill these guys down here? Oh. I thought there was going to be another heirloom down here. Can I go through this door? No. That was a waste of time. So much of a waste of time, I made you watch it! <laughs> Wait, so where's the other two? Where's the other two heirlooms? Oh, well, I could just get this one again. Yay! There's three heirlooms. <laughs> And I'll just grab this one again. I grabbed two of the exact same one. They'll never notice. They'll they'll never notice. I mean, I probably the pro the aliens are probably in there as well, like the other proper two. But eh. Oh, I've lost my rested bonus. Ah, oh, that barely ever happens to me, because I usually just leave my characters and just never log on to them ever again. 
That's a shame. Now, if you could do me a favour and not see me as I walk through the store, that would be grand. It was just one favour! Ah, yeah, there they are. One, and probably down there as well. Yeah, yeah, they're here. Well, hey, they're just going to get the exact same ones, so... Oh, could you die quiet, please? Uh, where am I going? I need to enter this room. Don't want to be seen by them. I need to enter this room, apparently. Oh, hi! I Sorry, I'm just interrupting your tea time. Do apologize about this, but, um... Consider it your last meal! Oh, they're all dead. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thought I was going to take more than that. We're nearly level 28. Nearly level 28. We're nearly level 28. You need to die, Bayless Commander. And I'm going to use her at the moment, because uh, we haven't got much time in this episode, and we need to uh, finish as best we can. Wait. Why didn't that work? Ah. Weird. No, you're facing the wrong way. Okay. And I'll take the data pad from your table, please. Whoa, you sort of did that very slowly, Harlow. Return to Lenteran! Um, which, which, which is, uh, uh which, which, which one do I need to go to? One that's kind of in the middle. There, yeah, Organo Castle. Lovely. Ooh, that's handy. It teleported me right at the top where I needed to go anyway. Ah, oh, thanks, game. I've got your heirlooms. You know, they're not exactly the same. They're completely different. Yes, they are. And I got the data pad, too. Rumours are filling the hollow frequencies of a daring robbery at our old estate. You've set a lot of tongues wagging. <laughs> House Bayless is missing a data pad from their new library. I let my dear sister have the honours. Never could decipher that blasted thing. It's a simple code, woven through the genealogical entries. You just have to assemble the letters correctly, Len. You're obviously the brains of this family, Sidonia. She's also very talented on the Vio flute. Oh, and a gardener, and a poet, and... Len, do shut up. According to this, we must pry open the droid's ventral servo-motor housing and disable its lateral conduits. The hollow chip is hidden within a false power storage unit behind a detonite charge, entering the disarm code. This is where you find it, Sam. sure we ought to be standing this close, Captain? I've got it. After all these centuries, we finally have our proof. The information on this holo chip proves House Turan is owed a considerable number of credits. When the other families hear of this, we will reclaim our status among the nobility. All that from a little holo chip. It's shocking what they can fit on those things. Then take this data and have it authenticated by the Royal Council. I'll see to our benefactor's payment. Uh -huh. I'm sure you will, dear sister. <laughs> he I'll, really uh, knows. I'll leave you two alone to negotiate. Call me when you need me, Captain. I suppose you'll be leaving soon. You don't seem like a man who stays in one place for long. Well, two is usually the romance button. I mean, I'm not. I'm not exactly in a relationship with Risha, so. I always have time for a gorgeous lady. There's a charming crudeness to your romantic gestures I can't help admiring. One advantage to being an honored guest at House Organa is access to their finest food and drink. I can arrange a special meal for the two of us. We'll eat and talk about your adventures. What happens when I run out of stories? Why don't we start a conversation and see where things lead? Follow me to the parlor. We'll pour ourselves a drink while we wait for the food. Aren't you glad you decided to stay? This is great, but it's time for me to go. Already have one foot back on your ship. I wonder what sort of woman it will take to settle you down. Risha! This data pad contains your payment for delivering the droid. It's the schematic for a powerful anti-radiation shield invented by House Turan. The shield will protect your starship from lethal cosmic rays. You should give the data pad to your business partner, Risha. What's she gonna do with it? Build the shield, I believe. I assumed you knew all this. I also have your reward for recovering our family's heirlooms. I'm especially grateful for those. 420 you credits. Your life wow. for House Tehran, and we'll never forget that. Farewell. 
Oh, am I done on Alderaan then? Oh, well that was... quick. Okay then. Well next time we'll be heading to wherever we're heading then. Oh, I think I just wanted to fly. So thank you very much for watching ladies and gentlemen. We're done. Hooray. And I'll see you next time. And a farewell to you.